Hello, Dave here again with my friend AJ. Uh, thanks for the feedback. Uh, a couple people have asked about a couple things. Uh, one of them is the environment uh, that you can teach your bird in. I chose to teach AJ in uh, kind of a chaotic environment, if you will, much more chaotic than uh, the table here that I'm using. Uh, the reason I did that is I kind of knew from our very first day of being on television that AJ would need to learn how to do his tricks. Uh, you know, in front of the camera, people, noises, etc. Uh, when you're on TV, the cameras, if AJ is right here, uh, a lot of times the cameras zoom up really close to him, so he has to be uh, used to distraction. So I guess to answer your question, uh, the environment you teach your bird in can really be anything. It's just they need to get used to it. Uh, it takes time. Uh, today it's going to be a simple trick. It's to do a flip around the finger trick. Uh, relatively easy. Uh, come here, AJ. What I do, first of all, a uh, couple tricks is um, I'll show him how to do it by, by using my hand. So a lot of you, we talked about how we can put our hands over AJ like this. Uh, so I get comfortable with that, or so, so does AJ. Uh, and then what I'll do is I'll take my finger and I'll push it around to his tail, and it'll kind of force him, force him around my finger. Another, tri another trick is if you turn your finger... This, this finger that he's on, if you turn it and do a flip, it kind of gives him a head start. So you can see that a real couple simple things. I use his tail since AJ's got a long tail. Your bird may have a shorter tail. Uh, use his tail, kind of push him around. Or another, another method can work that works is just hold him here and just slowly say, AJ, do a flip. And then he'll want to come back up on his own. So if you can start him off upside down, he'll come back up on his own. Okay, so you can start to figure out that if he gets upside down halfway, he'll come back up. So now if you turn your finger, you'll start to get him to go down, and then you can turn your finger back a little bit, he should come back up. So uh, that's, the, that's the trick, the easy trick uh, for the day. Uh, let's try it, AJ. We do a flip. Good bird. So you can see, me, you can see that um, I don't need to turn the finger or do any of that anymore because he understands what I'm what I'm saying. Another trick that works with none of the trick, another tip that works with all the tricks is I always try to give two clues: one verbal and one visual. So I'll always say, um, whether it be uh, the play dead trick, I'll always say play dead so he understands. Play dead is what we're doing. Of course, and then I show him what to do. So he has two ways to reference it. Well, that wasn't very good. Let's try it again. Play dead. Get up. Okay, so, and then same with the, with the do a flip. Do a flip. I'll, I'll put my finger around just a little bit. And, of course, on the rollover, on the rollover trick, I'll use my finger and I'll tell him, AJ, roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Good bird. So you can see that there's lots of different ways. But uh, for today, a recap the environment. Do it wherever you'd like. Give him space. Make sure there's nothing that he's scared of or she's scared of. Um, you can have music going, loud noises, whatever the case may be. That's fine. Uh, and then just to be patient. You know, if your bird is not doing it, uh, that's fine. It's going to take... One try, 20 tries, maybe a 1,000 tries. It sounds crazy, but uh, AJ doing the somersault, for example, takes a long time. Believe it or not, holding the golf club in his beak will get to golf shortly. Uh, the golf club in his beak, very difficult because he wants to turn it sideways like a worm or a stick and snap it in two. And so getting him to hold it lengthwise uh, takes time. So anyway... I hope that helps you for today. Uh, another easy trick, keep the feedback. One other thing, uh, we have a new Facebook page, so uh, definitely uh, be a Facebook member. We're going to try to see if we can get to a million Facebook members. Uh, that would be awesome. Uh, we also have MySpace and YouTube, so again, if you can help spread the word, we'd appreciate it. Uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.